yo, quick video. I gotta call O'Shea Do Jackson out, man. Just like his hundred video talking about just pearly. And no, I'm not caping for just pearly. I'm just saying. This dude got a mad on for this one woman making hundred videos about this chick. And I do have to call out the hypocrisy because O'Shea do Jackson right. I remember when this Asian woman came out by the name of Kim Chi Karen, right? I remember when she came out and had not very nice things to say about brothers, right? O'Shea Du Jackson made a video about the situation, talking about guess who's mad. And he was seeing like he was championing what the woman said. He was championing what Kim Chi Karen was saying, championing her talking points. In her rhetoric, and I know that's the pro-black side of O'Shea Du Jackson because he's trying to do do this whole Pan-African thing, and he's on this Afrocentric thing as well. It's like you came out and support a whole Asian Becky who has something to say about black men, but because this actual Becky, actual Karen, or Melissa Stacy, whatever you want to call her, an actual white woman came out. And she's getting her opinions on certain black topics and stuff. You want to come in and try to go in on her and stuff. Make a hundred videos about the chick. And I'm like, oh, shit. Like, you can't you can't be serious. Like, what, what side are you on? Because let some non-black chick come out and say something about a black dude. And it's like you're supporting what that chick said. But let a white woman come out and let her say her little opinion about certain black topics and shit you in your feelings so it's like just like what side are you on are you on the brother side or are you not because i know you play both sides of the fence o'shea tends to play both sides one minute he support brothers then the next minute he's against brothers and he support the um the shea butter chicks one minute, oh, he down for brothers then. Let some non-black chick say something about brothers like that, right? And then he's on their side. It's like, what side are you on? It's like, pick a side, O'Shea. D- this is blatant hypocrisy. It really is hypocrisy, dude. Damn, why you didn't make a hundred videos about Kim Chi Karen, dude? Or, or, or all these other females who got something to say. Why you just singling out just pearly? I can say this for sure. I didn't see any videos of her like disrespecting black men specifically, throwing black men under the bus. I didn't see that from just pearly. I don't really watch her videos. I've seen a few of her clips and that was it. I don't really watch her content. I never seen her take shots at black men. And you you claim you're supposed to be for the brothers, but you don't move like that. Meanwhile, you had Kim Ji Karen, right? You didn't make a hundred videos talking about her or going in on her. You made a video supporting what she said. And then you were talking about Asian Becky calls out black men and, and guess who's mad. And then you had a thumbnail of her right beside some ashy, dusty looking black dude. He's like, what, what side are you on, dude? Like you're contradicting yourself. And I'm not even sub to O'Shea. He just came up on my notification. No, not notification, but recommendation. This is getting ridiculous, dude. Now he's talking about how she's talking about black celebrities and dissing them, making money and views out of black celebrities while dissing them. How is that even different than celebrity gossip? You got a lot of content creators on the internet, especially in the space obtuse to the manosphere, right? They make video content talking about celebrity gossip talking about celebrities and trying to put a low-key red pill spin on it guys like anthony spade and i'm not trying to throw him under the bus i'm just saying for argument's sake guys like meteor tutorial and other and other guys and shit and even other females why you why you got something to say about just pearly but you ain't got nothing to say about them and this is why hey I hate inconsistency bro I hate hypocrisy and I hate inconsistency this is really getting tiresome and 
It is what it is, dude. I'm just calling it out. This is blatant hypocrisy, dude. 